Chapter 966 Wu Dong Qian Kun The resplendent and enormous lightning glow struggled wildly in Lin Dong's hand. Waves of wild and violent energy that caused one's expression to change rage, causing the surrounding space to become distorted. Lin Dong's hand had also become dripping with blood due to the wild and violent explosion of lightning energy. However, his hand had already turned numb from the impact. In fact, even the intense pain was unable to spread. However, Lin Dong's eyes became increasingly sharp in the face of this intense resistance from the Lightning Emperor Scepter. The devouring ancestral symbol within his Niwan Palace turned into a huge black hole. Waves after waves of devouring power surged out along the meridians within Lin Dong's body. Finally, they followed his hand and poured into the Lightning Emperor Scepter. Bang bang bang. Continuous explosion sounds exploded on the thunderbolt formed by the Lightning Emperor Scepter. When Lin Dong's devouring power surged into the scepter, the thunderbolt power that permeated it immediately began to expel these external forces. These lightning energy originated from the thunderbolt ancestral symbol and were relatively overbearing. They would not allow any other power to occupy their territory. However, this time around, the overbearing thunderbolt ancestral symbol's power had met an extremely troublesome opponent. Their so-called berserk power had lost its sharpness in the face of Lin Dong's devouring power. Each time they clashed, the devouring power would seep in from every opening and slowly devour the thunderbolt ancestral symbol's power. Although this lightning emperor scepter possessed the power of the thunderbolt ancestral symbol, it was ultimately not the true thunderbolt ancestral symbol. On the other hand, Lin Dong's body possessed the devouring ancestral symbol, which was on par with the thunderbolt ancestral symbol. These two confrontations were not on the same level to begin with. Hence, with the flow of time, the resistance from the Lightning Emperor Scepter gradually weakened. Devouring power stealthily spread and began to take control of the Lightning Emperor Scepter. Lin Dong stood in the air above the large hall. At this moment, he was grabbing a thousand feet large thunderbolt in his hand. His body was relatively tiny when compared to this thunderbolt. Moreover, the lightning glow that occasionally spread from the thunderbolt caused one to worry that his body would be directly turned into dust by the scattered energy. Quite a number of experts within the large hall watched this scene with cold eyes. They naturally did not believe that Lin Dong would be able to subdue this lightning emperor scepter, which had rendered all of them helpless. However, their cold gazes only lasted for a long time before they gradually changed. This was because they discovered that the originally extremely berserk thousand feet large thunderbolt had actually become a little more docile. This change caused everyone's pupils to shrink abruptly, after which, shock surged within their hearts. Could it be that Lin Dong had really tamed the Lightning Emperor Scepter? How could this be? This was something that even profound death stage experts were unable to accomplish. Who? Under the many shocked gazes, Lin Dong's tightly shut eyes slowly opened at this moment, as an arc rose from the corners of his mouth. Return. A low and deep cry was suddenly emitted from Lin Dong's mouth. After which, everyone was shocked to see that the lightning dragon-like thunderbolt had actually shrunk rapidly at this moment. The lightning glow was withdrawn, before it once again transformed into a ten feet large silver scepter. Lin Dong's blood dyed hand tightly gripped the scepter. There was a wild joy that could not be hidden surging within his eyes. His eyes were searing hot as he looked at the scepter in his hand, while amazement flashed across his eyes. No one knew what material was used to make this lightning emperor scepter. Its entire body was as bright as silver, and there were countless cryptic and complicated lightning symbols carved on it. The lightning symbols flickered, appearing just like many lightning eyes that were filled with a mighty pressure. There were eight lightning dragons roaring furiously at the top of the scepter. A palm-sized silver thunderbolt lingered at the middle of the lightning dragons. Traces of lightning arcs flickered on its surface. Finally, they followed the eight lightning dragons and poured down, covering the entire scepter. An indescribable majesty was being emitted from the scepter. It felt as though whoever controlled this scepter would be able to control the lightning of the world. Lightning Emperor Scepter Lin Dong's hand tightly gripped the scepter. Soon after, he involuntarily parted his mouth and smiled. By relying on the devouring ancestral symbol within his body, he had finally succeeded in subduing this treasure. He has actually subdued the Lightning Emperor's scepter? At this moment, 
those absent-minded experts in the large hall finally regained their senses. Immediately, someone involuntarily cried out. His voice was filled with jealousy. The expressions of the three Yuan gate members nearby turned a little ugly when they saw this scene. The three of them attacked together. However, the Lightning Emperor's scepter still landed in Lin Dong's hands in the end. Lu Shangxuan also gently clenched her teeth. There was some unwillingness in her eyes. Such a treasure could be considered a top-tier treasure even in their mysterious sky hall. The atmosphere in the large hall had clearly become a little tense at this moment. The eyes of many flickered, while rich greed and murderous intent were present within them. In the face of a treasure, any fear would gradually weaken. Lin Dong naturally sensed those greedy gazes. His expression immediately turned cold and indifferent. The Lightning Emperor's scepter in his hand also faintly flickered with lightning. Swoosh. At this moment, Mu Lingshan had also rushed to Lin Dong's side. The life death coffin cover in her hand also rippled with black light. Lin Dong, hand over the Lightning Emperor's scepter. That is the target of my nine serene gate. The tense atmosphere in the large hall did not last for long. A cry that was filled with unwillingness and resentment suddenly resounded. Pang Hao and the three nine serene gate demon generals beside him rushed out at the same time. After which, sharp attacks directly greeted Lin Dong. You are courting death. The chilliness in Lin Dong's eyes suddenly intensified when he saw that Pang Hao still dared to attack him. He did not shrink back even a little in the face of a perfect profound life stage expert and three peak advanced profound life stage experts. Instead, his body rushed forward, while thunder rumbled on the Lightning Emperor's scepter in his hand. Bang! The Lightning Emperor's scepter danced as tens of thousands of thunderbolts whistled around Lin Dong's body. At this moment, he was just like the Emperor of Lightning, walking within the lightning. An extremely wild and violent thunderbolt directly spluttered out from the Lightning Emperor's scepter. After which, it tore through space and ruthlessly collided with Pang Hao's group at a shocking speed. Boom! A shocking loud sound resounded within the large hall. After which, everyone saw that the faces of Pang Hao's group had instantly turned completely red. Soon after, a mouthful of fresh blood was wildly spat out as their bodies flew backwards in a miserable manner. In a single exchange, Pang Hao's group had actually been completely defeated. The eyes of many experts within the large hall shrunk. Although Lin Dong was able to defeat Pang Hao outside of the Thunder Hall, he did not do it in such a clean and decisive manner. Clearly, this was the might of the Lightning Emperor's scepter. Brat, you are courting death. The gray-haired old man from the Nine Serene Gate had a furious expression on his face. With a furious roar, he suddenly threw a punch forward. Majestic Yuan power turned into a pillar, with Death Chi lingering on it, as it ruthlessly smashed towards Lin Dong. Lin Dong's toes pressed on the empty air, as his body rose into the air. The Lightning Emperor's scepter in his hand was violently swung. Immediately, thunder resounded, as over a dozen thunderbolts whistled out and directly collided with the Yuan power pillar. Bang! Wild and violent fluctuations erupted within the large hall. Air waves swept out as Lin Dong's body flew backwards by a hundred feet. After which, he stabilized himself. The ferocious attack of the gray-haired old man had actually been directly received by him. Ha ha. Lin Dong stabilized his body, as he involuntarily laughed towards the sky. With his current strength, it was originally an extremely difficult task for him to face off against a profound death stage expert head-on. However, with the help of the Lightning Emperor's scepter, he was already able to not fall into too much of a disadvantage. In terms of offensive strength alone, the Lightning Emperor's scepter was clearly stronger than the Burning Sky Cauldron. Of course, the interior of the Burning Sky Cauldron had its own domain. This was something that the Lightning Emperor's scepter could not compare with. Both of them had their own unique mysteries. Obtaining the Lightning Emperor's scepter had clearly caused Lin Dong's fighting strength to soar once again. While Lin Dong was laughing heartily, the gray-haired old man's expression had become extremely gloomy. The strength of the Lightning Emperor's scepter caused even him to be a little fearful. When he exchanged blows with Lin Dong previously, the latter did not dare to face him head-on, and could only rely on his speed to tangle with him. However, with the Lightning Emperor's scepter in his hands, Lin Dong had begun to possess the qualifications to face him head-on. At this moment, 
even he could not help but feel a headache. Chapter 967 Wu Dong Qian Kun Following the volatile change in the gray-haired old man's expression, the noise within the large hall became much quieter. Those experts, who originally had greed in their eyes, frowned tightly. Clearly, the fighting strength that Lin Dong had displayed caused them to be extremely fearful. Brat, you are indeed quite capable. However, do you really think that you have the qualifications to challenge my Nine Serene Gate? You should understand that as long as you leave this Sky Lightning Sea region, my Nine Serene Gate will be able to chase you to the ends of the earth. The gray-haired old man stared at Lin Dong in a sinister manner. His words contained a rich threat. Since I dared to snatch something from the demonic wind cave, you should also understand that I am not afraid of such threats. Lin Dong held the lightning emperor scepter. He stepped on the empty air and laughed faintly. The gray-haired old man's eyes turned cold. However, his voice soon became gentle as he said, As long as you hand over the lightning emperor scepter to my nine serene gate, I can guarantee that we will let bygones be bygones. I believe that there should not be anyone in this world who wishes to become enemies with a large faction, right? Behind him, Pang Hao's expression immediately changed upon hearing these words. He was just about to speak when he was stopped by the gray-haired old man. Immediately, he clenched his teeth unwillingly. Lin Dong merely smiled upon hearing this. Soon after, he shook his head and said, I do not wish to offend anyone. However, if you want me to hand over the treasure in my hands, there is only one word. No way. You. Murderous intent involuntarily surged within the gray-haired old man's eyes when he saw that Lin Dong did not give him any face. Clearly, he was extremely furious. Lin Dong was not the least bit afraid upon seeing this. With a wave of his sleeve, the sky-devouring corpse once again appeared beside him. Lightning glow once again flickered on the lightning emperor's scepter in his hand. The gray-haired old man's aura turned sluggish when he saw the sky-devouring corpse appear beside Lin Dong. Previously, he had exchanged blows with this strange puppet. However, he was held up by the latter until he could no longer bear it. All of his attacks seemed to be completely useless against the latter. You will regret this. The gray-haired elder's eyes darkened. At this moment, the strength of the people beside Lin Dong was not weaker than them. If they were to forcefully exchange blows, it was likely that they would end up attracting the attention of others. Lin Dong remained unmoved, however, his eyes started to flicker faintly. The Lightning Emperor's scepter was already in his hands. However, this was not his only objective. He still wanted to enter the Thunder World and obtain the super treasure that he had coveted for many years, the Thunderbolt Ancestral Symbol. However, in order to enter the Thunder World, he would need to obtain the other two Silver Tower Keys. Although his fighting strength had soared, it was still a little forceful for him to deal with the experts from the Nine Serene Gate and the mysterious Sky Hall. He had to think of a way to get those two silver tower keys. While Lin Dong was silent, some of the experts in the hall gradually suppressed the greed in their hearts. Since they were unable to obtain the Lightning Emperor's scepter, it was better to see if they could obtain other treasures. With this thought in mind, some of the experts spread out and began to collect some of the treasures on top of the stone pillars in the hall. Lin Dong did not pay any attention to their actions. This was because he discovered that the Nine Serene Gate, the mysterious Sky Hall, the three Yuan Gate members and some of the experts with exceptionally powerful auras were actually not moving at all. However, their faintly flickering gazes allowed others to understand that they seemed to be thinking of something. Haha, <laughs> everyone, according to what I know, there seems to be some rather special items within the Thunder Hall. A large man with a whip suddenly laughed amidst this strange atmosphere. Both of the large man's arms were scarlet red in color and looked extremely peculiar. Moreover, his aura was also extremely powerful. Although he had yet to step into the profound death stage, he was clearly at the perfect profound life stage. Upon hearing these words, a thought flashed through Lin Dong's mind. Looks like he was not the only one who knew about the existence of the Thunder World. It is rumored that it is a special space. In order to open that space, one needs three silver tower keys. The one who spoke at this moment was the man with drooping hair from the Yuan Gate. After which, he tilted his head and looked towards the Lin Dong trio, as a faint smile surfaced on his face. Upon hearing his words, the surrounding experts with exceptionally powerful strength also turned their gazes towards Lin Dong, 
Peng Hao and Liu Shangxuan. This was because the three silver tower keys were currently in the hands of the three of them. The three of you, please stop hiding at this time, right? Don't tell me that you want to monopolize that space? The man with drooping hair said with a smile. May I know who you are? The gray-haired elder's eyes slightly sunk as he looked at the man with drooping hair. He could sense a sliver of danger from the latter's body. Eastern Zon region, Yuan Gates Huo Yuan. The man with drooping hair said with a faint smile, These are my two junior brothers, Chen Ling and Li Lei. Upon hearing these three names, Lin Dong was initially startled. Soon after, he suddenly thought of something, as his eyes abruptly turned dark and cold. He slowly said, The three of you, are the three little kings from the previous Yuan Gate, right? Huo Yuan smiled and nodded his head. His gaze paused on Lin Dong's body as he said, Looks like the three of us have quite a good reputation in the hearts of your Dao sect disciples. I never imagined that there would still be people who remember us after leaving for so long. How can you forget, during the previous great sect competition, my Sky Hall's big senior sister died at your hands. Lin Dong's eyelids slightly drooped as he said. Oh, you're talking about that woman, haha, ha. she did indeed die at our hands. Huo Yuan smiled. Soon after, he said, however, our methods are inferior to yours. Hundreds of elite core disciples of my Yuan gate were all directly killed by you. Your methods, tisk tisk, truly ruthless. Lin Dong's face was indifferent. He merely stared at the Huo Yuan trio, before faintly nodding his head and saying in a soft voice, If I have the chance, I will take your lives. Courageous, it just so happens that the three of us are also planning to kill you and send your corpse back to Dao sect. The silver-haired Li Lei beside Huo Yuan parted his mouth and said with a smile. The conversation between both parties caused some of the surrounding experts to gawk. Soon after, they came to a sudden realization. It turns out that both parties were from the Eastern Zon region. So Lin Dong is from the Eastern Zon region's Dao sect. It is said that it is also a super sect. And its strength is not the slightest bit weaker than our mysterious Sky Hall. Lu Shangxuan's beautiful eyes were somewhat astonished as she looked at Lin Dong. She never imagined that the latter would have such a background. However, this did not cause them to feel much fear. After all, although the Tao sect was not weak, they were unable to interfere in the chaotic demon sea. You are currently quite famous in the eastern Zon region. Haha, <laughs> even the three great sect masters of our Yuan gate were unable to kill you. It's no wonder that you were able to stir up such a huge wave not long after arriving in the chaotic demon sea. Huo Yuan laughed. As these words rang out, the atmosphere within the great hall instantly turned stiff. This time, even Lu Shangxuan's beautiful eyes were filled with unconcealable shock. Even the three great sect masters were unable to restrain Lin Dong after taking action at the same time? Although they did not know exactly how powerful the three great sect masters of the Yuan Gate were, they were definitely not weaker than their sect masters. Therefore, they should be three samsara stage super experts. Who in this world would dare to look down on such a lineup? However, this Lin Dong, who was merely at the advanced profound life stage, was actually able to escape from their hands. This fellow, exactly what kind of monster is he? Thick graveness surged within the eyes of Lu Shangxuan and the rest. When they looked towards the indifferent Lin Dong once again, they felt that this fellow seemed to have become even more mysterious. Immediately, the fear and dread within their hearts deepened. Haha, <laughs> as of now, I do not have any intention of attacking you. Our objective for this trip is the Thunder World. Therefore, I would like the three of you to take out your silver tower keys and open the Thunder World. Huo Yuan waved his hand and said. Staring at Huo Yuan, Lin Dong smiled and nodded his head. As of now, opening the Thunder World is indeed more important. He clearly understood that the current situation was rather delicate. The various experts were all on guard against each other. With his current strength, it was clearly impossible for him to forcefully snatch the three silver tower keys. Since that was the case, it would be better for him to open the Thunder World first. As for who would be able to obtain the keys and enter, that would depend on one's own ability. At the very least, Lin Dong did not fear anyone in such a chaotic battle, as long as he was not targeted by everyone. As he spoke, Lin Dong clenched his hand, causing a silver tower to appear in a flash. Faintly discernible sounds of thunder rang out. Upon seeing this, 
the eyes of Lu Shangxuan and Pang Hao faintly flickered. After exchanging glances with the people beside them, they finally nodded their heads. With a flip of their palms, the silver towers appeared in a flash. As the three silver towers appeared at the same time, lightning suddenly extended out from their bodies. In the next instant, the silver towers flew out, before coming into contact with each other in the middle of the large hall. As lightning flickered, they gradually fused together. Hum! As the silver towers fused together, a lightning bolt suddenly shot out. The direction that the lightning bolt shot towards was the lightning emperor stone statue within the large hall. Chi Chi! As the lightning bolt shot onto the stone statue, silver light instantly sparkled on it. In the next instant, the space at the chest area of the stone statue slowly distorted, as if a spatial vortex was gradually taking shape. At the instant that the spatial vortex appeared, Lin Dong's gaze instantly turned boiling hot. He knew. The thunder world was definitely within that space. Furthermore, the thunderbolt ancestral symbol was definitely within it. 